Hi, I'm Baz, this is iSharpen, and today I want to introduce an innovation to the new knife sharpening jig. Now, as you can see in this picture here, the, the new SVM45 jig has a horrible top holding thing, right? It, it doesn't work, it just doesn't work, right? Um, and what I, what I love about the old jig is that it had this beautiful thumb cup here, right? So you pop your thumb in there and you've got a good, positive, solid mount for your knife sharpening. So yesterday I had a chap come in, wanted some knives sharpened. I said, what do you do? He says, I'm a retired engineer. We got to talking and he's got some machines at home. And I told him about the problem of how I wanted this, this to fit onto the new self-centering knife jig. This is a new self-centering. I've polished it. They're not normally polished, but... So um, he went and had a think about it and he came up with this design. It's fantastic. He's bolted this on. I'll show you up close in a minute. But um, what I'm hoping is that I can create this cup by itself and uh, maybe 3D print it or uh, get someone to manufacture it. This is made of PVC. Um, and what I'm hoping is that you can cut off that T piece at the top. That'll give you a round disc and you just glue it in with some JB Weld plastic or some Aerodite or something like that, some epoxy, and that should stay in there and there's the problem solved. Now, some say, what about the adjustability? I've never used it. I've sharpened thousands of knives, never ever had a need to turn this and adjust it. What for? You've got this thing here for adjustment, all right? I don't understand. Tell me if I'm missing something, but this is a solid mount. It fits perfectly. It's the same height. Right, ish, right, it's the same height, good enough. Um, and it retains this feature here if you want to do convexing, right? If you want to do some convexing, um, and it gives you a good solid thumb mount so that it works. Look, I'll show you, it works beautifully. I have good, proper anchoring now with my thumb. It's a solution. It's a fantastic solution. It's elegant. It's simple. All you have to do is grind, cut, hacksaw off your top bit, glue this on, problem solved. I can't think of a way that it would be simpler. It's brilliant. I'll show you up close. So here it is. You can see that in my version, the prototype's been screwed on, but we were thinking about it later. I thought, well, why couldn't we just glue it on? Why couldn't we? Indeed, we could. There it is. That's you put your thumb in there, right? And you clamp it there and you do your thing. We've got the self-centering, right? The original hinge is still there. Everything is still there. We're not violating or impinging on anybody's patents or anything like that. So Tormek should probably do this. Why didn't they do this originally? I don't know. But they have obviously got rid of the adjustment. So they, the new one doesn't screw up. It just sits there. So that's not needed anymore. And I just think it's a fantastic, elegant, beautiful engineering solution. So, um, as you saw in the picture, this has a little T-piece that sticks out. You've got to cut that off. That leaves you with a, a round disc that, that will sit beautifully into here, the recess. You glue it on, job done. Lovely, jubbly. Oh, I'm so excited. What do you think? What do you think? Put your comments below. I want to hear them. Is this a solution? I, I think that because you can't get the old SVM jigs anymore. They're not making them and they're not selling any that they've got in stock. They probably threw them in the bin. But this thumb holder is essential for stable knife grinding. It's essential. There's no question about it, right? Um, and so this combines the new with the old in a beautiful, elegant, fantastically engineered solution. What do you think about that? Should I get some made? Uh, yes i'm gonna get some made beautiful beautiful i love it thank you to my engineer i know he's watching he asked to be stay stay keep me out of it he said i said no worries no names or anything but uh, he knows who he is and um his solution was just fantastic so happy soon as i felt it soon as i started to use it i knew 
that it was it felt exactly the same as the old jig but now we've got self-centering so that problem's all gone i can do thick knives i can do thin knives everything's going to be perfect perfect i'm so excited look forward to reading your comments see ya <laughs>